comes later back from my children and break it and we eat it. Jesus took bread when he'd given thanks, he broke it and said, take, eat, this is my body. Do this in remembrance of me. He took the cup. The third cup is the cup of redemption. This is the focal point of the whole evening. Miss everything, but don't miss this. This is really, and you're not taking notes, but this is, this, this is the one you want to remember. I know, I told you, you don't have to. You're off duty. Yeah. Homeschoolers get off program. But you've got good mind. You'll do fine. This is the cup of redemption. This is the third cup. This points me back to the dripping blood of lambs on doors. The effusive blood. The blood that got Jewish people out of one country into another at one time. But he said, this cup, it's the new cup. In my blood shed for a whole lot better purpose than that. So now it's not the blood of lambs, this is the blood of the Lamb of God. Now it's not one people getting out of another people, this is all people getting out of sin. This is not just a one-off happen, well, maybe it'll work for a while. This is for an eternal covenant. This is a better covenant all the way around. And he said it's the new covenant. New covenant. New covenant. Here's Peter, here's James, here's all the boys sitting around and maybe some other ladies. And he says, it's the new covenant. And that would have flashed on them, wait a minute, new covenant. We've had that one time in the whole record of Tanakh, in the whole of the Older Testament. One time that phrase is used. Jeremiah 31, repeated again and again throughout the record of the New Testament. And that is, God said through Jeremiah, Behold, days are coming, says the Lord, when I'll make a new covenant with the Jewish people. Not like the covenant I made with them when I brought them out of the land of Egypt. My covenant which they broke, although I was a husband to them. This is the covenant I'll make with them after those days, says the Lord. I'll write my law in their hearts, and they'll all know me from the least of them to the greatest. For I will forgive their sin and remember their iniquity no more. God is instituting in Yeshua the new covenant as he took the matzah and the wine, both symbols of the lamb. He said, this is now the greater lamb. This is the greater redemption. 